working to change and bridge the gap between real and real cinema and take the Indian film industry closer to its global dream. And hence, I think it's just as well that we are introducing these awards in this beautiful setting at the US consulate. And uh, I think we need to give a huge round of applause to people who've contributed to letting us have this wonderful venue. So if you could all join me in giving a really warm, warm, warm round of applause to everyone who's you know, made it work. I'm Minnie Mathur, and um, I'm going to be introducing you to the awards and a whole lot of um, things that are going to be happening today. Uh, let me just, you know, you must be thinking, oh my God, this, this is just another award show. What is so new about this award? Well, ladies and gentlemen, the Indian Academy Awards is a real-time celebration of cinema lovers, by cinema lovers, and for cinema lovers. And it is actually going to go across the world. By this, it has actually become a truly global and democratic award ceremony. And it is going to redefine the entertainment world. It will be hosted at the Oracle Arena in the Bay Area, Silicon Valley, in California on 7th and 8th to July 2017. This extravaganza will be nothing, nothing short of a mega, mega show that brings about the best not only in Bollywood, but Hollywood and Tollywood together to create history in the entertainment world. Now to kick off this inauguration and talk about the ceremony in greater detail, can I please call upon the director of Brainstorm Entertainment, the company that's actually founded and masterminded the IAA. Please welcome on stage, Mr. Saurabh Pandey. Hello. In my life, this is the first time I'm giving any speech. So I'm 100% sure I'm going to fumble a lot, do lots of mistakes. So please, please, please forgive me. I've never spoken in my life ever. I can't believe. OK. Also, because the first time, so you have to apologize. I will go by reading. So I was just sitting with Ali Bhai. He said, when Modi can read, you can also read. <laughs> OK. So to start with, uh, I would like to begin by thanking each one of you. And this is coming from my heart. Because I never thought that this evening I will be able to see. And to be very honest, sitting from here, there's so much light, I can't even see anybody. Uh, OK, today is the beginning of a new journey that I dreamt years ago. It gives me immense pleasure to share my happiness with you at the launch of the Indian Academy Award conceived by Brainstorm Entertainment. Thank you once again. Thank you. I've always been a movie buff. I'm kind of who eat, sleep, and drink movies. People who know me personally, they know what I mean. Because somewhere in the past, they have gone through the torture and all the things because of me. So pardon. But that passion has now turned up into a global offering in the form of Indian Academy Award, which with, with love we call IAA. The dream that I saw would have not reached this stage if I didn't have the support and guidance of two people. That's very, very important, ladies and gentlemen. I need to start with this. These two names are close to my heart, and I hold huge amount of respect and love for them, and will remember how they stood be all my life. And they are Mr. Ali Murani and Mr. Shamak Dawar. Thank you, sir, both of you so much. I remember the day when I met you for the first time and discussed this. You said, Saurabh, Go ahead, and we are with you. Thank you so much. Uh, before I go further, there are a few other names I like to mention because they are the friends who always help you in the journey. Uh, just like to quickly share the name because there are a few friends who are sitting up outside India also, in states also. To start with the name from Mr. Dr. Vijay, Ritu, Ayush, Silky, Mr. Gansham Bhai, Sanjay Bhai, Ankur, Kumar Mohanji. Uh, I don't know where Kumar Mohanji is sitting. I can't see him. Again, he is someone who has always helped me big time. Uh, Mr. Naresh Gupta ji, uh, I have a friend who, two friends who just fly on today afternoon from US just to attend this press conference and they are leaving by 10 p.m. in the flight back. Um, Sanjay Bhatnagar and Raj Rahi, thank you so much. Uh, Mr. Rahul Chanda, thank you so much for coming all the way. Gurmeet, I can't see you wherever you are. Okay, now I always wanted to do something big and beyond Bollywood. I always dreamt of seeing my favorite stars sharing the same stage. I'm a huge fan of South Indian films, Hollywood films, and of course, Bollywood, that I have grown watching since my childhood. 
This dream of bringing Hollywood, Bollywood, and Tollywood together on one stage is the big idea behind Indian Academy Award. What else makes is one of its kind is the fact that it is an award by the people and for the people. We are creating a platform for all movie lovers, fans across the world who will be able to share their views, express, chat, and vote all at one place. All these people will be the part of the Academy who will have the right to express their likes and dislikes throughout the year at our website. It is an attempt to bring the stars and films closer to each other and connect as they do in real life. Indian Academy Award will be seen as a huge celebration for the fans globally who have come together to vote for their best films, stars, actors, and so on in the form of the Grand Award Night which will have happen year by year. And look at the perfect timing. With the newly elected US President and our dynamic Prime Minister, Mr. Modi, whose global wisdom and leadership has taken the relationship between two countries to another level. Here we announce the Indian Academy Award that will not only boost our cultural exchanges, but also strengthen the bond we share among two countries. Last but not the least, uh, I'm humbled to have Mr. Shahrukh Khan on board with us who has mesmerized the Indian the global audience with his presence and films all over the world. Sir, I thank you for gracing the occasion with your presence. I also thank all the media people. And before I leave the stage, another two last names. One, my wife, with, without whom I'm not been able to stand here. I even can't see where she is sitting. And my business partner, Vanna. My son, oh, my son is saying, Papa, yes, Ronnie, you are here. Thank you so much. Thank you again from bottom of my heart. Saurabh, there are a few questions that I'd like to ask you. So tell me, uh, tell all of us, California, it's a very, uh, it's, it's, I don't think we've had a movie, uh, you know, award ceremony based there before. Why did you choose California? Okay, you know, Mini, we did uh, almost three years of research before locking California, and we are doing in what the world calls Silicon Valley Bay Area, because uh, in the last two years, we have traveled at least, I don't remember how many times, and we saw the people there, the warmth of people there, the madness about Indian cinema. I will not use the word Bollywood because Bollywood, everybody's mad. Yeah. But the best part, as a whole Indian cinema, they are just crazy. You just name the film, name the star, they know. So after doing a whole hell research, we thought, okay, let's go and do in California Bay Area. Wonderful. It's, I'm sure it will make uh, a lot of film lovers really happy. The other thing that, that struck me as very unusual is that, you know, in so many awards, we still find, you know, the regional cinema, which is now, of course, called Tollywood, Tollywood and Bollywood Awards together, but you've also included Hollywood. So how did you think of encompassing all these three industries all in one? Okay, this is a very, uh, very uh, uh, small, uh, I will not like to detail more right now because this is a play some surprise for the future also, yeah, but uh, on a personal note, uh, I started my career with the Hollywood studio called Columbia Tricer Films which is based out of there, so I, I'm a very big fan of Hollywood. And again, uh, in the last five years, if you see the Hollywood is creating a big impact in Indian market, and we love Hollywood stars also. So using our personal relationship, friend, network, and now Mr. Samak Dawar and Sinek there, why don't we give our audience a pool of Hollywood stars also? So as I said, let the surprise picture of Ibaki and Mere Dost. Fantastic. I think this would be a great point to show everyone a short AV on the Indian Academy Awards. Yes. Are we ready? Are we ready? All right, let's 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 go for it. Here's the Navy. I'm sure the anticipation levels are at another all-time high after seeing this. It's, it's an academy that all of us have really been waiting for, a, a valid voice that encompasses all, all forms, all regional parts of the film industry as well, the film fraternity. Um, I'd now like to call on stage our next dignitary, who is the chairman of the Las Vegas Indian Chamber of Commerce, Visit USA Committee. Please welcome on stage Mr. Manoj Gurshani. Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. Uh, the whole concept or the whole culmination of today's meeting started when I think we had uh, Tom Wider, the Consul General, US Consul General, had a luncheon at his house, and I had a very special friend of mine, Mohammed Murani who's part of Senegal, uh, attend that. We were brainstorming and post this meeting, post the luncheon meeting, we said, why don't we do something with the US consulate because whom I work very closely with because of my uh, visit to USA committee chairmanship and the Las Vegas Indian Chamber of Commerce. And then it is culminated and almost manifested into us all being here with the mega superstar SRK, which you'll hear shortly. And uh, again, the world is a small place and uh, 
then I realized the team which is put together also coincidentally uh, or synergistically we know them. Another good friend, Shamak Davar, who the Indian audience and now the global audience don't need an introduction, is choreographing the whole show. And Shamak, it was lovely interacting with you earlier also. And uh, it's lovely that you're part of it. And of course, then I figured Saurabh is playing a role. And I've been knowing Saurabh from the ex uh, Toyfa days when it was happened in Vancouver. And so it's a synergistic that all of us, and you know, and hopefully, and I, for me, my support to the Murani brothers, Sinayug, is lying unstinted. And I've assured them on behalf of especially the Las Vegas Chamber of Commerce, we will leave no stone unturned to ensure that whatever we can do to make it a huge success. Last but not the least, I would like to thank once again the Consul General Tom Vaida, who's a good friend and who's made it all possible. And of course, there are many people in the concert who made it happen, but three uh, people who really worked very hard to put it all together, that's Jennifer Larson, Kevin, who, uh, Irwin, and then we have Heidi. So thank you, I can't see all of you, but thank you individually and for making this happen. I really appreciate that. With this, I think you're waiting for much better speakers to come on and stay and talk to you. Thank you so much, Mr. Goshani. Thank you. And I'd request you to stay on stage. Ladies and gentlemen, up next is a man all of you already know. And uh, saying anything about him would uh, really not do justice to what he's all about. He is the guru of contemporary dance in India. And he's the man who's actually introduced contemporary jazz and Western dance forms into mainstream Hindi cinema. He's been paving the way for new dance talent all over the country, and he is the choreographer of the Indian Academy Awards as well. We are very happy to have with us today national award winner and India's foremost contemporary dance choreographer, ladies and gentlemen, the one and only Mr. Shamak Dawar. Few words? Few words. Uh, thank you so much for everything. I'm extremely honored to be here when this idea was given to me uh, many years ago by Mr. Saurabh Pandey. Uh, it's his dream come true, and I have my Senayuk family, my Manoj, and of course the great SRK who's going to come and just do so much for our country and the countries together. I'm very honored to be a part of this. Thank you, Manoj. Thank you, everyone. And uh, we really hope we zap you all because there's Hollywood, there's Tollywood, and there's Bollywood. Now that's a fusion you've never seen before, so get ready. Shamal, just a couple of questions. You could, you could take the mic. I, you know, I just wanted to know, you have you know, worked on so many different award ceremonies. What is going to be so special about the IA? I think I've never worked in a, in a framework where I've had um, the whole of India, and Hollywood, never had it before. And to work together on the same platform is a completely different thought process. So my properties, my costumes, my sets, the way we do the fusion of North, South, East, West, Hollywood, and the brainchild Mr. Muhammad Morani is always with me, always holding my hand throughout the whole thing. So I just want to say it's going to be absolutely very new and very novel. And that too in sunny California. In California. Great. We can't wait to see what thank you're going to you. put out there, Shamak, and thank you so much. Ladies and gentlemen, um, next up is a very special man. He holds a very special place in my heart, at least. He is no surprise that they are associated with the Indian Academy Awards as well. Let's just take a quick look into the world produced and executed by Sineyog, right here. We director of the Sineyog Group of Companies, the magnificent Mr. Ali Morani. Good evening, everybody. <coughs> Welcome to this beautiful venue, the U.S. Consulate Grounds. Uh, they gave me a little paper that to speak and introduce myself, but I think there's enough introduction being done. Kind word by Saurav, Shamak, and there was an AV with Manoj. So I think I'll take the opportunity of thanking each and everyone who has come here, the media, and uh, thanks to Tom Rajda for allowing add the team, that is Jennifer and Heidi and Kevin, everybody has supported us so much to get this thing going and making it successful. And of course, I want to thank Shah Rukh Khan, my dear friend, who without which 
We can not succeed in anywhere, anything that we do. We made it a success because of his support and love. Thank you very much once again. God bless. Thank you, Alibai. Request you take a seat. And now, ladies and gentlemen, I request the esteemed presence of the U.S. Consulate Journal, Mr. Tom Vida. Please give him a huge round of applause. Thank you. Good evening, everybody. Please let me welcome you to the U.S. Consulate General tonight. It's a real pleasure having you all here, and it's a real pleasure, a real personal pleasure, that we'll be joined tonight by Mr. Shah Rukh Khan, who is not only one of the biggest film stars in India, but really one of the biggest film stars in the world. Speaking very candidly, when Bollywood stars come to the consulate, normally it's to get a visa. Certainly it's not to see me. So let me just take advantage of the opportunity with so many film people here, film industry people here, to say that if you're looking for a uh, over-the-hill, middle-aged American extra for a movie, you know, I'll give you my business card. But really, it's, really it's, a thrilling, it's thrilling for us to be able to here support the launch of the, uh, of the Indian Academy Awards. And I think the fact that the first event is taking place, the inaugural event is taking place in California, which is the home of obviously the American film industry, is very fitting. And it's also fitting that it takes place at a time when Bollywood and Tollywood movies are becoming ever more popular in the United States. So these Indian movies are seen in mainstream mo movie theaters all over the United States, many times hundreds of screens at a time. And my understanding is that films from India are now the number one, do the number one business of foreign language films in the United States. So that's really, that's really great to see. And I think, I think really the fact that the Indian Academy Awards are taking place there, the fact that we're trying to, and happy to see more Indian movies made in the United States, all that stuff will just continue that positive momentum. We're also thrilled that a number of American studios are very active here in, in India. This is really something that our two countries share. The most, we have the most dynamic, vibrant, and innovative film industries really in the world, and I think it's a really a strength that we can build on. Uh, and in fact, we'd like, to, as I said, love to see uh, movie stars like Shah Rukh Khan go to the United States, love to see films being made in the United States. And let me just make a general plug. So we see this great facility, which we opened about five years ago, in large measure, so we can provide better services, visa services to Indians. We'd love to see Indians traveling to the United States, whether it's for education, Business, film tourism, last year we saw over one million Indians travel to the United States. That was a record. We'd love to see more Indians travel to the United States. Really, we're open for business in that regard, group travel, any kind of travel. So please do consider the United States for your destination, just as the Indian Academy Awards has done. So I'll, let me just stop there and again say what a, what a real thrill it is for us to be able to host this event tonight and to be able to partner with the Indian Academy Awards. Uh, again, I'm not a Bollywood actor, otherwise I might break into song and dance, but I think that would be painful for me and painful for you, so I think I'll just stop there and pass the microphone. But thank you again, and a wonderful evening. We wish all the best for the event. Thank you so much, Tom, and I think you'd be great if you did some Bollywood dance moves. I'm sure you'll, you'll get the opportunity. And now, ladies and gentlemen, um, no one really is more worthy of being called a global icon than the man who's coming on stage next. A man who has ruled Hindi cinema for over 25 years. He is the undisputed king of the Indian film industry. Please put your hands together for Mr. Shah Rukh Khan. Thank you. Uh, good evening, everyone. And uh, first of all, thank you all of you who are on stage. Uh, uh, Manoj Saab, Ali, Shamat, Tom, and Saurabh. Uh, team which is trying to bring together uh, what we might seem like, oh, one more award function. Uh, but that's all right. I think more the merrier. And the idea here is to uh, authenticate, make it uh, something which is a little more real, honest, upfront, and different in terms of even performances uh, that will happen later on in America. And um, when I was told about it, the Indian Academy Awards, I was, uh, I'm happy that we would be able to do this in America, and there's a platform which they'll explain to you, I'm sure everybody's been talking about it. Uh, it's a platform where you're not only getting uh, Hindi cinema or Hindi films, you're getting even the South Indian uh, films to be participants. You're also getting some of the films from Hollywood, which we may have liked here in India or otherwise, and include them uh, in the awarding process, uh, which kind of uh, first helps India. Uh, you know, to have far-reaching effects for the cinema. We are the oldest filmmaking nation in the world. We made the largest number of films, but we still do need an expansion in a market which will uh, make sure our cinema goes uh, worldwide. It's been uh, some time that we have not been able to achieve that. So I thank uh, all the people here on stage, all the teams which are participants now, to try and make this happen. For me as an actor, as a producer, as an Indian film person, 
the most important thing is can our cinema reach worldwide? And uh, Tom has been extremely helpful and extremely uh, uh, kind in allowing us, uh, uh, you know, uh, access uh, to America to be able to hold this function accessed here um, <coughs> at the embassy and uh, everyone who's uh, been busy behind the scenes at the American Council. A big thank you to you all for uh, uh, taking this initiative. And uh, personally, Tom also likes Bollywood films, so I'm going to take him for a few dances and teach him some. And Shamak is here already. I'm sure he'll start choreographing. And um, just, just a little mention that you know the process has been explained, will be explained as we talk here, and you'll get to know more about it. But to create an academy, to create a, a world uh, where all the fans, so to say, can participate in choosing the films online by a, a very simple registration process I've been made to understand on the website that will be launched, I'm sure now. Um, it, it, it just uh, amalgamates, includes everyone in the process uh, of deciding which films they like, uh, not only just in terms of popularity, but in terms of content, design, and style. And anyway, with social media, everybody is such a big participant now. I think it's high time we legalized it, organized it, and put it on uh, floor as the Indian Academy Awards are planning to do. So uh, my best wishes. I'm to perform there, and I'm sure a lot of uh, other Indian actors and actresses will also participate. I'm sure uh, there'll be participants from uh, the American film industry and, of course, uh, the most loved South Indian film industry. So it'll be really nice to have all of us going there, enjoying ourselves uh, for a two-day uh, function, I'm explained, which also includes fashion and music and, of course, uh, the award function or the ceremony which follows. So thank you very much, all of you, for being here. Once again, the whole American Consulate, Tom, and everybody present on this dais for putting this together. I'm honored to be a part of the first Indian Academy Awards. Thank you so much, and have a very good evening, everyone. Thank you. Wow. So, Shahrukh, you've actually... Okay, sorry. I'm, I'm sorry. <laughs> you actually pretty much covered yet. everything that we needed to ask you. You're, you're, you're that good. But I just wanted to, you know, uh, just a little thing about whenever we've looked at the Academy Awards that happen in, say, Hollywood, everyone here in our industry says, you know, we don't have an Academy that is as, you know, as together and as solid and as uh, sort of uh, integrated as, as, their, as theirs. Um, but in these awards, it's the people who are going to be choosing uh, do you really believe it's the people who, who decide whether a film is uh, worth putting out there or, or an academy? I think it's a big discussion. Uh, whenever I get an award which is jury decided, I like the jury. When I get the popular one, I like it. <laughs> but uh, but I, I think but if you can have a fusion of both, I think uh, uh, the Oscars, the academy has been able to uh, maintain that. They have created an academy. Uh, I'm sure they also have loopholes and there will always be discussions about uh, how the awards change around there. Uh, you know, each one of them will have its own loopholes and issues and uh, uh, discussive points. But I think a beginning like this, where people can come online, vote, at least gives you a popularity idea, if nothing else. Mm -hmm. And then if you have a, you know, a set of people behind the scenes, uh, as I'm sure they will, you know, to get the cue from there, and within that choose the winners, maybe a, a, a fairer judgment of how a film should be. Less foolproof. Uh, nothing is foolproof, <laughs> but yeah, okay. A little Great. Less, yeah. We look forward to it. We we'll look forward to your participation in the Indian Academy Awards. And now, ladies and gentlemen, the moment that um, we are here for, the unveiling of the big IAA trophy. Ladies and gentlemen, um, can I please request um, Mr. Shah, Shah Rukh Khan to now unveil and give us the first look of the Indian Academy Awards trophy, please. Awesome. Ladies and gentlemen, we now uh, request on stage uh, Ms. Vandana Krishna, the director of Brainstorm Entertainment, Mr. Kareem Murani, Mr. Mohammad Murani, Mr. Mazar Nadiarwala, and Mr. Karan Surma, all directors of the Cineo Group of Companies, to join us on stage for a quick photo op before we open the stage for a Q&A session. <laughs>
you so much gentlemen thank you thank you miss krishna and now um, we are going to open the stage for some questions from the media we have people with uh, microphones in the audience so please uh, if you have any questions um, our panel will be happy to answer them can we see a show of hands so we can send the mic over to you wow this is the shortest q and a i have ever conducted this is brilliant which obviously means that our panel has answered all your questions and and we are we are pretty good with all the information we need is that good there is all right can we have a mic going back there please yeah thanks uh hi sharuk uh it be from... nice if you stood up and we could see yeah, you yeah sorry it's a little dark i can't see you and speak a bit louder please uh hi sharuk ravi from abp news शाहरुख पहले से ही इतने सारे अवार्ड्स हैं इंडिया में भी और आउट ऑफ इंडिया भी आईफा टॉयफा होस्ट किया जाता है ऐसे में क्या लगता है कि एक और अवार्ड और जैसे जैसे अवार्ड बढ़ रहे अवार्ड्स बढ़ रहे हैं वैसे वैसे अवार्ड्स की क्रेडिबिलिटी कम होती जा रही है कई सारे स्टार्स बॉलीवुड में भी अब अवार्ड्स का मजाक उड़ाने लगे आपने भी कई बार मजाक किया लहजे में कहा है कि मैं तो बस यूँ ही चला जाता हूँ अवार्ड्स ले लेता हूँ तो ऐसे में एक नया अवार्ड इसके बारे में क्या कहेंगे I think यार थोड़ी सी चीज़ आप टेलीविजन से हो ना एक्चुअली आई थिंक थोड़ा टेलीविजन ने बर्बाद कर दिया अवार्ड फंक्शन को ऑनेस्टली क्योंकि अभी क्या हो गया है कि जो भी अवार्ड का फंक्शन होता है वो टेलीविजन फ्रेंडली ज़्यादा हो गया है जी ई सी के लिए ज़्यादा हो गया है और ये बहुत दुखद बात है मेरे हिसाब से बहुत सारे हैं और शुरुआत बहुतों की एक अर्नेसनेस और एक एथिक के साथ होती है कि वी विल ट्राई टू गेट द बेस्ट Uh, possible way to judge uh, popularity or the uh, critical content of a film and filmmakers and actors and actresses but kahin na kahin par hum us loop mein phas jate hain i won't i won't take away from the fact that everybody tries to be credible i think everybody tries to make the best effort possible but i think uh, reasons of commerce and economics sometimes uh, don't let it go to the extent so uh, the assumption every time is ki jab bhi ek award function naya wala aata hai और एक ऐसे प्लेटफॉर्म पे ऐसे लोगों के साथ जो एक अर्नेस्ट एफर्ट कर रहे हैं सो so होप पे तो दुनिया कायम है सो यू अज्यूम दिस वन इंडियन एकेडमी अवार्ड्स विल मेक श्योर कि प्लेटफॉर्म जैसा भी हो एंटरटेनिंग हो कि कैन वी गेट एंटरटेनमेंट एंड द ऑथेंटिसिटी एंड द क्रेडिबिलिटी ऑफ अवार्ड्स टू मिक्स इन सच अ वे दैट यू कैन वॉच बोथ यू हैव अ ग्रेट फंक्शन ऑन टेलीविजन एंड यू आर एबल टू ऑल्सो अप्रिशिएट द फैक्ट दैट मे बी पर नॉट योर मोस्ट पॉपुलर चॉइस एज वन but somewhere down the line the correct choice as well ek aur sawal pehla pehla award function to america mein hoga to zahir hai ki ye alag alag deshon mein hoga to kya india mein bhi kabhi ise aayojit kiya jayega kuch is bare mein bata sakte hain sara baba answer karna chahenge ye ah namaste thank you aaj ki date mein to hum iska answer dena shayad possible nahi hai but ha agle 5 saal tak to hum puri duniya mein zarur ja rahe hain बट वी लव इंडिया और पाँच साल बाद ये देखेंगे कि अगर uh, हम सारे हॉलीवुड स्टार्स को इंडिया में ला के इतना बड़ा शो कर सकें तो वाई नॉट मेरा डीम तो यही है कि जितने भी हम हॉलीवुड स्टार लाने की सोच रहे हैं उन कम से कम दो दर्जन लोगों को हम इंडिया लेके आएँ जिससे कि आज तक इंडिया भर में भी कहा जा सके कि ऐसा शो आज तक इंडिया में कभी नहीं हुआ गुड इवनिंग एवरी वन माई क्वेश्चन इज टू मिस्टर शाहरुख खान शाहरुख यू वन शाहरुख Sharuk you won many awards until now which is the one you hold closest to your heart the next one <laughs> <laughs> Sharuk but is uh, Oscar the only benchmark for bollywood celebrities sorry Oscar is the only benchmark for bollywood celebrities is it oh you still have the mic yes okay okay there yes, someone else hardik you from book my show sorry I, i couldn't get you so is is Oscar the only benchmark for bollywood celebrities uh you know when you, when you see a property like oscars which has been going on for years it may not be i mean one i, I think it's inspirational if not a benchmark you know they've been going on for years they've uh, uh created an academy everybody looks up to it not only that the golden globes the bafta uh, there's some amazing awards even uh, uh, you know in in other countries we may not have access to them or see them as often but oscar of course is the most popular and most viewed but i think uh, there is a system there which can be 
inspirational in terms of trying to take a cue from a good thing that already exists. So I'm not saying it's the benchmark that you're going to try and create uh, a mini or a, a Oscar clone, but somewhere down the line, if there is a good thing and uh, you know, kind of shows us or leads us to a path where we can create a property which is Indian, about Indian films, married with the Hollywood films and South Indian films, and inshallah, all the films in India and all the languages, I think it's, uh, it's okay to take the cue from there. Uh, but don't consider it like a benchmark. Uh, create our own benchmark with uh, maybe this one, inshallah. Sir, but if you get an opportunity to choose one out of two, uh, one is award and second is reward, personally, what would you personally prefer? So, uh, uh, which, which do I? So what do you personally prefer, awards or rewards? What is reward? What is the difference? The thing that you get in return, the love that you get from fans, it can be a reward. Okay. Uh, so, you know, I question not jump this question. आपको खुद भी नहीं जम रहा है थिंक शाहरुख किया तो किया हाय यू हैव वन एन नंबर ऑफ अवार्ड्स डू यू कीप अ टैप ऑन द अवार्ड्स दैट यू हैव वन सो फार डू यू कीप अ काउंट एंड इफ यस हाउ मेनी हैव यू कलेक्टेड सो फार विल यू जज मी इफ आई से यस यस आई डू आई लव अवार्ड्स आई हैव नेवर मेड अ मेड एनी बोन्स अबाउट इट एंड आई हैव सेड दिस ओपनली समटाइम्स इट मे बी टेकन रॉंगली but I love being a movie star. I love being an actor. I love winning awards for my work. Uh, you reach a stage in your life as an actor, and I've been working for some years now, where uh, you know some kind of uh, recognition. Uh, all artists, whether you're a poet, a singer, a painter, a dancer, a choreographer, uh, you, you just want applause. And somewhere down the line, uh, any award that I've received, I've always uh, thought of it as collective applause for the work that I've done in a year or for a specific film. So yes, I do keep tabs on awards and I want to keep winning them. And I try very hard and I work very hard to get them. And when I don't get them, I feel extremely sad. <laughs> Shahrukh, the second part of the question is very interesting. Have you ever sat and dusted and counted your awards? Uh, no, I, I don't want to <laughs> limit them. That would be them. psycho. <laughs> I don't want to limit them. But having said that, I've been told I've got 267. Woo! <laughs> <laughs> That's a mean feat. Please notice. This is down to the decimal point. Shahrukh, um, yeah, yeah, right in yeah, the center. Right. Yeah. Uh, Shahrukh, uh, as we know, like Hollywood uh, stars and Hollywood films will also be uh, involved in uh, IAA. Uh, so how do you think Hollywood celebs or Hollywood actors or stars will take this uh, particular award? Because we all see them uh, joking about Bollywood movies at times. They are not aware of the uh, industry that we have over here. So how do you think they'll take it, uh, Hollywood stars? Whatever little experience I have uh, of having spent time with the American artists, uh, they are extremely gracious people, let me say that. And you notice that in their award functions. There's a lot of graciousness. I think the presence of all the actors, actresses, directors, producers, writers, uh, whenever an award function is there, quite outnumbers the ones we have. I think that's extremely graceful of them. Knowing fully well, they might not win the award tonight. But they all, uh, you know, the award is... Um, uh, placed on such a uh, pedestal that people think just being there or being nominated is a big thing. That's one. Second, the reason for an Indian Academy Award or award functions which we are taking abroad is to introduce Indian cinema to the world. Uh, when you say if somebody does not, is not uh, knowledgeable about our films or perhaps even in some cases because of the lack of knowledge looks down upon it, I think it's a duty as filmmakers um, to take this platform and say, okay, these, this is what we do. And I'm sure we also sometimes uh, judge everybody's films. It's not that we don't judge. We also like some films, and we don't like some films. I think it's important to take this platform for the Indian oldest filmmaking country in the world and say, listen, this is the stuff we do, guys, and uh, you know, participate. And I think there would be graciousness enough from both sides uh, where everybody will accept it. So if we, if we, if we, if we uh, get short-sighted and say, Ki, what will they think, they make fun, Everybody makes fun of everything, and that's all right. But I think it's a duty to introduce people to our work, our film industry, and uh, our way of making films, so that uh, this lack of education uh, can be overcome. Thanks, Shahrukh. Yeah. Nice. Hi. Can I ask a question? Mini? Yep. So my question is to Saurabh, though I'm a big fan of Shahrukh, but may I ask a question to him? Saurabh, S Saurabh is right here. Prashant here. And okay, you know, right it's here. great to see you up there. I know this is your dream come true. What has been your biggest? Could you hold the mic closer to your. What's What's been your biggest challenge so far in the journey to today? Uh, honestly, uh, biggest challenge. Uh, uh, the challenge was very hard, but because of 
Ali bhai and Shama Gavar, uh, when you get two pillars with you, your, your fear goes away. Um, uh, to also just to add what the gentleman just asked a question to Shahrukh, that how the Hollywood makes fun. To be surprised, my friend, they love Bollywood. They love Bollywood stars. Because in this journey, I met so many Hollywood people. And the moment we discuss about the show, they are just waiting with open heart to welcome Indian cinema to their land. Um, so and in a short while, in a short answer, it was a wonderful journey. And I'm very happy that today we are here. Great. Great. Thanks. Is there anyone else? Lady here, right in front. Um, this question is for Mr. Saurabh. I'm from Hindustan Times. Uh, sir, uh, you will be having a global audience voting for the best, uh, for the winner of the award, rather. Who will be shortlisting the nominees? We will have a jury member very soon, which will be announced very soon. And another question is, um, since it's a global audience again voting, isn't it more likely that the popular star will win rather than the best performance? Okay, that's the way we, we are saying as an academy, um, the, the, the how different we are trying to say that it's a year-long process will keep on going. It's not that something that if the event award is happening X month, just three months before we start the voting. Our logic is very simple, that whole 65 days people will keep on coming on our site, on app, they will keep on writing, blogging, everything. Basis on that, that's how it will, we will celebrate in the form of the award show. Thank you, sir. Uh, Shahrukh? Here, center. Sharuk, if there is one award that has eluded you, it is the national award. I remember uh, during FAN, you had joked about retiring after getting a national award. Uh, but personally speaking, do you feel, is, is there any performance of yours that really deserved one? Because for me, either it was Chakde or Swades for which you, you, you should have won a national award. So if you could just tell me. You know, I, I come from a place where uh, um, I think audience and jury members and my filmmakers have been uh, very kind that I won lots of them. For me to sit back and say, I could have won for that, uh, would be demeaning uh, you know, any award. If I didn't get it, I didn't deserve it. Uh, it's as simple as that. So I don't think there is any performance of mine till date which could have or should have got a national award. I don't perform according to winning an award. I just hope uh, you know, something turns out well. And it's not just me, the 100 people making the film. Uh, the one that I'll get it for, inshallah, if I keep working hard, will be the one I deserve. But I don't think, if, if I haven't got an award, I don't deserve it. It's as simple as that. But have you actually said you're going to stop making films after you get one? That's why they've stopped giving me the award. That they is don't want probably me to why there's a <laughs> Otherwise, they would have given it to there's me. There's a as collective soon as I said. nation wondering. They will never give me these awards. Never get it. <laughs> right. So, who else? Uh, can I see hands or are we done here? Do we have any more questions? Yeah. We're done. Okay, there's a lady there. Hello. Yes. No, no, that's fine. Okay, so are we done? Uh, All right. Good evening. Uh, oh, there. May, may I? You can't see anything. Sorry. All I'm right just here. in the second yes. row. Yes, yes, yes. We on the uh, on your left side. Uh, we saw you. Good evening, uh, sir, uh, Badsha, King, uh, uh, Raj, uh, Mr. Shah Rukh Khan. It's it's a great pleasure that you are here. Uh, I like Saurabh has been a great movie buff. Have been watching movies since you know. Uh, ages and you know uh, Alamara, Ra Raja, I'll take one minute to come to the question. So uh, in the these I have watched you know uh, taken videos, uh, uh, watched a series of movies of Raj Kapoor, uh, Shami Kapoor, um, all stars and I love them all. But what touched me most, most over the decades and over the years are three, three stars who have really you know uh, got very close to me. One is Dilip Kumar Saab. One is uh, Amitabh Bachchan, and the third is none other than Shah Rukh Khan. And uh, I think the way, the way you hold the stage, the confidence, the entertainment, I haven't seen a, a global star like this. A star who holds the stage, the way he takes lead, and you know, uh, the smartest, the wittiest, uh, it, it's amazing. So I just want to put a question that, uh, uh, what is the input that you give today to yourself for de developing to this level that you come every time to the stage and you give uh, every answer of your was like a golden word coming out and that's why you are there and we are here <laughs> so so what is that input that you give to develop yourself daily like uh, gymming 
reading uh, what what develops you more ex ex apart from the you know apart in from short the, what makes you Shahrukh Khan <laughs> today today what basically is basically you're asking me what am I smoking yeah <laughs> <laughs> now I'm uh, to be honest here I've, I've been doing this uh, nearly half my life before that I was training to be an actor in theater and thank you f so much for your kind words to even uh, mention my mention my name in the same breath as uh, the legends you did Dilip Saab and Amiji uh, I'm a big fan too. I wanted to be a film actor or part of films because of them. We all are. I think most of our people in our generation were. And uh, what one does is one honestly believes, uh, you know, after having worked so many years in films, that these matter. Films matter. Film people matter. Film stories matter. The award functions matter. And more than that, the people who are watching films matter. Uh, and as soon as you uh, wake up in the morning, have respect for it, not look down upon any of these things, that, oh, is silly they didn't understand my film yes they understand my film completely every film they understand uh, whenever your film does well they appreciate it completely as soon as you have respect for the work that you're doing and believe that what you're getting up to do matters I think uh, answering something or being a part of it comes automatically you don't have to prepare it I don't think I have any I'm, I'm a very shy person personally I don't have any sense of extra confidence uh, I, I take most of the people who work backstage with me behind scenes would tell you someone like Sharma I, I don't have that kind of confidence, but I believe that making films in India and wanting to take it international matters because that's who I am because of. And the people matter who made me and made the whole film industry. So uh, whenever something is asked, you take that with that earnestness. Um, you add humor only if you don't know what to answer. Uh, but otherwise, uh, uh, that's all it takes to be the, um, I said, guess, though I, 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 I'd like to add Many a times I'm not very proper on stage either. Uh, so it's, it's not that I get it right always. Uh, when I'm doing a show, yes, I prepare a lot. You, for you're always perfect. Um, thank you. <laughs> I'm, I'm glad I can. Absolutely. Now let me tell you one thing important because yeah. I know him from the last 25 years with broken bones, which I keep on firing about, that please be careful, please look after your health. He will still listen and follow everything we say to him, the steps, the movement, the entry, the prop, everything we say, Shahrukh, you, you'll hurt yourself, you'll hurt yourself. Don't do that, it's okay, I'll change it. No, no, I'll do it, I'll do it. That's, and he is so humble, not only with my dancers, but with every single person backstage. He has respected people, and that's what's come back. Yeah. This is something I know about Shahrukh Khan, and I can vouch for that. That is what I love about the man, his respect for people. I haven't seen a person who goes and you know the control the uh, stage, a stadium full of people the way he does. And uh, from the audience side, you know, uh, my answer to the press guys are, it is never less to see Shah Rukh Khan as many times in a day, as many times in a year, as many times in your life, and same for the entertainment. Cheers to that. Thank That's very very sweet. All right, there's a lady there. Can we have a mic over to her, please? The lady uh, in the white. Mr. Murani, a question for you. Uh, yeah, go ahead, go ahead. <laughs> yes, go ahead. Please. Yeah. It's usually ladies first, but you just took over the mic. Fine, go with your question. <laughs> Mr. Murani, if you had to go back in the past and recall the first day when you met Shah Rukh Khan, how was it like? How did the meeting go? And what did you think about him? The first day I met Shah Rukh Khan. Oh, that'd be interesting. Well, that the man was full of confidence even that day before his even first film which was released which was Diwana and I think we met to sign up for a show at the Sea Rock Hotel and I can't tell you what kind of confidence he gave. He said I'm going to be the biggest star of the country. <laughs> Pay me what is due to me. <laughs> that right. was the beginning. Okay, then the lady in the yellow right ahead of you, so in the red shirt. Are we done? <laughs> okay, she wanted it. All right, but gentlemen. Okay, one second. I just, I'll just wind up because it, it seems like a good evening for me. Everybody seems to be liking me. So, <laughs> <laughs> uh, once again, uh, you know, the, the, I'd like to uh, personally thank uh, Tom and the whole American Council because you know, if you don't have this kind of backing, um, and I've noticed, I've had a few conversations with him, even uh, apart from this award function that they are initiating now. Uh, but the kind of help and the platforms that is being offered there is going to be outstanding. I want to tell Saurabh, um, I want to thank Manoj, actually, 
for allowing this to happen to. And I want to tell Saurabh that this opportunity that we've all got, uh, just being a film buff, make sure it adds and counts. And of course, you have the best of talents with Sine Yug and uh, Brainstorm and of course, Shah Magdawa. And we'll get a lot of uh, artists from here, Hollywood and South of India. And I think uh, this platform of Indian Academy, in, in Indian uh, Awards uh, Academy should be, uh, should take away all the issues we have with award functions. And we should work towards that. I'm, I'm not trying to be patronizingly giving you advice. But like I said, it's been a good evening. So I'm feeling like a star, so I'm just letting you know. And uh, uh, thank you very much and uh, you know, for all the support always uh, for every endeavor of the Indian film industry. Thank you very much, everyone. Thank you, Sharab, for thank supporting you, and giving this confidence. Thank you. Thank you. Can we all ask you to please step forward for a small photo opportunity yet again for the press? And ladies and gentlemen, thank you very much for coming here to support the IAA. Um, let's keep it. Uh, thank you so much to the media as well for your insightful questions, your presence. And let's just wish the Indian Academy Awards all the very best. And thank you once again for being here. Good evening.